as many of you know, Dick Clark passed away yesterday at the age of 82 from a heart attack. Many of you who follow music and TV, but particularly game shows, in my case game shows, know him very well from Pyramid and various incarnations, uh, the Challengers, the Krypton Factor, Winning Lines, the list, there's a lot of game shows on that list. And naturally you would expect certain channels to dedicate maybe some programming to him, pay tribute, and GSN is going to pay tribute to him. However, it leaves me feeling really empty to know that basically other than an, an extra hour of Pyramid on Saturday to replace Million Dollar Password just for that Saturday, they really aren't going very far out in doing much. They got a little 15 second tribute bumper which is nice but still makes you wonder what if Richard Karn had passed away and they're gonna have specific episodes up for the Friday marathon but it's still gonna be some of the same rerun abused episodes of $25,000 Pyramid that really makes you wonder they couldn't for one night just one night decide to put a little bit of money into maybe getting a couple different episodes maybe have a very special marathon I mean think about it in 2007 when Merv Griffin passed away did they half-ass it with Wheel and Jeopardy those two mornings when they had the marathons? No, they didn't. When they had Wheel of Fortune, we got very special episodes. We got a Chuck Woolery episode. We got Vanna White's debut. We got the syndicated premiere. We got the uh, daytime finale for Pat with the Kiss. They didn't... And with Jeopardy, they showed the Million Dollar Masters tournament. So they didn't just say, okay... This season that we've rerun for five years, we're just going to put that on, and that will be it. Now, granted, I will admit, it is kind of abrupt that for his passing, and when they did the Wheel and Jeopardy marathons, they did not have them on the regular schedule, I don't believe. So that made them unique, and they had to, they had to be more creative with that. But still, you couldn't tell me that with so many episodes of Pyramid that could be available now, a lot of them aren't, but you got countless episodes you could have went back through all the eras and maybe shown one here, one there, from maybe show some of those uh, $10,000 ones, the ones that exist, obviously, or some from the $20,000 Pyramid. Do you, you telling me you can't do that? Or more appropriately, they won't do that. And, and the sad thing is, as angry as I would be about them just putting, slapping together something and being cheap about it, it doesn't really surprise me. Because after all, those 31 episodes of Richard Karn feud are so important and so vital to the schedule that they have to be shown without interruption because we just cannot get enough of our Al Borland. Now, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's sarcasm. But that's basically what you get with the brain trust that still thinks, despite the failure of stuff like Amazing Race and Dancing with the Stars, that the possibility of creating five reality shows is a great idea for the network. So really, I... It, it just is the status quo and another reason why the current leadership of the network is going to kill it, I think. I, I don't want to say that, but it, it seems like it's just the inevitable. Like, you're just waiting for that other shoe to drop. I really would like to see if it had been someone that they really loved, like a Karn or a, a Sherry Shepard, if they had tragically passed away. Because even though I don't like their shows, I still don't wish death on anybody. What if they had passed? You would be getting the best of their shows for at least six hours. Not something you could just throw together any Friday. I think Dick Clark deserves a lot better than what GSN is trying to give him. Because it just reeks of laziness. And... Frankly, 
they're they should be better than that. And I my I'll probably still watch some of the episodes. They are gonna give it an extra hour, but it's just two episodes they didn't rerun on the Pyramid Block on Friday. So again, they're half-assing it. Simply is uh, simply sad. I'm sorry. You could do better, GSM. If you ever learn how to actually try something other than Family Feud on your schedule.